Have you ever built a puzzle? At first, there are a thousand pieces and you don't know where to start. So you go for the obvious, edge pieces. They're the only piece that has an obvious place. I'm a magnet for edges. You're a magnet for edges? Check it out, Daddy, look. Wait, Ruby, does that make you edgy? <laughs> <laughs> don't get me wrong, every piece has a purpose, but some pieces just have an edge over the others. With the border in place, we are able to frame the bigger picture and left with a foundation to work with. Our lives are like a puzzle, a thousand pieces that fall to earth. We have every piece we need, but every piece's place is not so obvious. The gospel of Jesus Christ provides a border with Christ as the chief corner piece. This year in seminary, you will be using Canvas modules to help you study the Book of Mormon. The scriptures are often like a puzzle. They have all these pieces that, when put together, reveal the mysteries of God and His Kingdom. On the days that you log into Canvas, you will enter the course and be greeted at the homepage. Your teacher will be communicating through the announcements above. Check to see if they have any special messages. After you check your messages, you'll click Modules in the navigation panel. This is where you'll find your assignments for the week. The modules will have the days assigned to them in their title, so you'll know where to begin. Click on the top link to start. Once inside, you'll be provided three pictures, or puzzles. All puzzles come with a picture on the front of the box as a reference. You can see what it looks like. But don't be fooled. Even though you know what it looks like in the end, doesn't mean you have all the answers. Often when building a puzzle, I seem to find pieces that make me wonder if they belong to a different puzzle altogether. You will choose which puzzle you're going to build by clicking on one of the three images. This will bring you to a second page. Everything you need will be here on one page. The first paragraphs will provide the border of your puzzle. Your job is to build the picture in the middle. Through prayer, study, and pondering, you will use the prompts, quotes, questions, definitions, and more to learn by the Spirit the truth of all things. By the end of the lesson, you may not have the big picture, but you have pieced together parts of the puzzle. If you want more, there will often be additional prompts inviting you to dig deeper. Sometimes, trainings will be provided on how to use the Gospel Library app to record your impressions and feelings. As you collect these smaller pieces of truth, you're going to want to preserve them in the Gospel Library app so that you can return to them again and again throughout your life. Once you're done with your study session, you're going to want to click on the Hear Him banner at the bottom. While you're working on one portion of the big picture, your peers will be working on the others. On the Hear Him page, you will be prompted to share with others what you've learned. Your teachers and friends will be able to read what you've learned and then connect their truths to yours. Likewise, you'll be able to see how your study session connected with theirs. By contributing to this page, you will also receive attendance credit for seminary. Life can deal out some puzzling pieces, but it is God who not only knows what the final picture looks like, but knows where every piece fits. Don't throw out a piece just because it doesn't fit yet. As you choose to participate, you will hear His still small voice teach you just how important a piece you are.